in what ways could I improve my CV? If you take a little look at that. Just be honest, be brutal. The youth of today are facing a terrifying job market. What? Don't believe me? Take a look at how terrified this youth is. Ah! How was that, guys? Nice. Yeah, very yeah, 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 yeah. scary. Mmm, <laughs> spooky. I'm convinced. You're probably sat there thinking, it can't be that hard to get a job. I managed it. Well, that was probably back in the 50s, Grandad, when any old candy ass down at the five and dime could land a gig if they didn't get caught lighting up the tilt sign. But exactly how hard is it to get employed? I've got a job interview later today to find out. Today's challenge, get myself a job. Now, before I start my journey to employment, I thought I'd take time to speak to someone with real experience in having a job. I'm speaking to Dr. Simon Fox, a dentist of over 30 years and also my dad. Hi. Hi, Dad. Hi, hello. Can you hear me? Get a job. No, sorry, we're, we're filming right now. I was just wondering if you've got any advice for me. Job. Yeah, do you know what? I'm going to get a job. Big fat loser. Well, I've lost 15 minutes and I'm no closer to securing my dream job. First thing on the agenda is to create an irresistible resume. My current one needs a toucher. But I've come up with a sneaky plan to help me out. I'm going to hold fake job interviews for a made up tech company and use the opportunity to just look at other people's resumes. I'm going to put the C in CV. That's not the building, it's the next one. Sorry, next one. Hey! hey. Nice to meet nice. you. Nice. Ah, nice to meet you. Lovely to meet you. What attracted you to this job, working at uh, super, superrealindustry.com? I mean, I haven't been an intern before, mm -hmm. but I feel like I should expand my skills and I think it would look good on my CV, and obviously it's good to get... Alex, mate, can we have a black coffee in here, please? Yes. I'm getting a bit tired. Is that your CV there? It is, yes. Okay, excellent. Grab that. Yeah, just let me grab it. The guy who you're replacing, who used to work here, he had a very specific job around the office. We just paid him a few extra quid an hour. And what he used to do is try and catch people watching pornography on company time. I'm going to be sat here pretending to watch some porn. I want you to try and sneak up on me and catch me watching porn. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, look at them. I thought that was illegal. That's disgusting. That's too, that's disgusting. Right, I can hear you there. Can you think quick on your feet? I like to think so. If I were to become your boss, not saying that's happening yet, but if I oh, were, right. what nicknames would you have for me? Um, Dumbo. We're going to just skip straight over that question then. That's can why I've not been asking that. Uh, you're a quiz host. Do you mind standing up and giving us, showing us a little bit of what that entailed? Sure. I would have a microphone, of course. And I'll be saying good evening, everybody. Welcome to the Manor Arms. So, question one is a movie question. What film was Harrison Ford in in 1980? Blade Runner. Oh. OK, we are finished. Using some of my covert techniques, I've managed to find some key ways I can improve my CV. First of all, I'm going to need real work experience. Number two, I should get it proofread. Number three, it wouldn't hurt to learn a second language. And number four, I'm going to have to lie a lot. Look at that. Uh, 2005 called. They want their picture back. Sorry, who called? <laughs> for the job interview. Patron! What is your name? I'm Zach Fox. So uh, tell me about your work experience. Uh, well, any... I've got this for you. I think you'll like what you find. Why are you naked here? Yeah, below that. Just read below that. Comedian, barman, Formula One diver. Kebabs, why? Why? You're passionate about the food or what about it? I like the way they feel in my mouth, the taste, the flavour. They're meaty, they can be spicy, they can be creamy. OK, and uh, when you're dealing with customer, what's a good way to deal with customer in kebab shop? Hello. Hello. Got order you a kebab if you want a kebab. OK, you, you can just... Oh, 
can you say, okay, say badly? I'm doing so badly. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I've messed this up. So, uh, what typical uh, toppings would you offer on a kebab? Oh, chili sauce, boss. Garlic sauce, boss. Um, cheese, boss. Do you want a can of Pepsi, boss? Wu Jai Shu Sai Chia Mo Chang. Okay, that will be all. I thought so. Well, despite my best efforts, I've lost today's challenge and had to move back in with my parents. I've not lived here since 2015. Unemployment is a hot topic at the moment, but the good news is soon robots will be doing all the jobs so we can sit back and relax whenever they tell us we're allowed to. Oh, sweet, that's Dad. Get a job. He said I did a good job. 